Today we're here at the San Diego Zoo Safari Parks Biodiversity Preserve with USGS and the Nature Reserve of Orange County monitoring and banding cactus wrens. A cactus wrens are a California species, um, a special concern, and their populations were very hard hit after the recent fires. And so we're trying to monitor their population and see what we can do to bring their populations back up. Cactus wrens are really closely tied to cactus. They use year-round nests for roosting and for breeding. And they need cactus that is at least one meter, which is around three feet in height. They tend to prefer these larger cactus patches for breeding. What we were doing today was attempting to capture some adult wrens to collect genetic samples. So we observed the birds for a while in the morning, became familiar with their flight paths and the way that they moved around their territory, and then strategically placed some mist nets in an area that they were likely to fly through. We actually caught a, a male and two fledglings this morning, placed metal and colored bands on their legs, which give each bird a unique color combination so that we can recognize individuals in the future. We um, perform various measurements on them. We measure wing length, we um, record some other characteristics, we weigh them. And then we uh, clip one of their toenails to collect a tiny amount of blood, and this is the basis for the genetics analysis. So ultimately we'll be using the results of the genetic study to look at how connected these dispersed cactus wren populations are. And we'll be able to determine if birds are moving from one patch to another and how they're doing that. In other words, what routes they're taking and what kinds of habitat they need connecting patches of cactus for birds to be able to move from one to the other. The San Diego Zoo Institute for Conservation Research is involved in a restoration project for coastal sage scrub. And within that project, we're trying to figure out how that restoration effort is affecting, hopefully positively, the cactus run population. So we're out planting cactus um, and monitoring the cactus run population to see how their populations are doing at the same time.